Namaste everybody. Welcome back. We are in India. We are um, going to learn a little bit some activities that we can do um, to go with India. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to learn about henna. So I talked to you guys about, um, we've done this before. We've learned about henna um, and we did some henna art on our hands. Um, obviously we're not there to be with you. So we're going to do it um, on our hands, but with paper. Um, so what you're going to do is you got a brown piece of paper that looks like this, and you may need some help with, um, an adult for this, but what you're going to do with these are my hands. Somebody helped me before. Um, and then I just traced them Well, mine are backwards now. So just traced my hands. So if I'm, you just have somebody, um, help you do that and then cut them out. Um, and then I'm going to cut mine out really quick and then we will come back to the video when I'm done with that. So, um, get your hands traced and then cut them out and we'll come back and I'll give you the rest of the instructions. See you in a sec. All right. Namaste everybody. Um, I am going to just show you, um, I've already got my hands cut out. We're going to finish doing our Rangali. So our, our henna. So I'm going to just, I just glued these. And then I just laid them kind of close to the corner here. And then I'm gonna do the other one, except for I just messed mine up. I didn't put it right. Um, on top of this one. So hold on, I just messed mine up. So I'm gonna have to glue it again. <laughs> I glued the wrong side. Um, so I'm just gonna glue it like this. Don't do what I did. Um, and then I'm just gonna put this on so it's just like that. I need to get something to clean that off quick. Hold on. Teacher, like I always say, teachers make mistakes, but Mrs. Chilson tends to make more than the average, I think. So, but that's okay. We learn from them, right? So what you're gonna do is that is what, um, you're just gonna let those, make sure those are on there really good. Um, glue them on. And then we're gonna do some henna. So henna looks like, um, if I can show you a piece here, maybe. It's very beautiful, but like you can do henna that kind of looks like, if you can see that without, it, yeah, something like that. So I'm just gonna take a black marker and they, and you're gonna do kind of like some swirls. I'm just gonna kind of start Just kind of like that. Um, let's see. Um, and then I'm gonna kind of maybe swirl it down and do some other ones. And you don't have to do everything I'm doing. You can do it however you want to, but henna usually has lots of swirls like that um, along with it. Um, and I might do something like but you want to keep it on on your um, hands. Don't try and get it on the cement or on the paper. Okay. Um, so you just want to do, like I said, lots of little designs. I wouldn't necessarily draw, um, you know, you could try to do some maybe stars or whatever you want to do. But I wouldn't like draw a picture of your parents on there or something or your baby brother or sister. I would keep it really simple. Um, just like this. So this is my one hand and I'm going to do the other one if I can. There's glue all over it. And you don't have to do the same thing, which is kind of the cool thing about it. You can um, do uh, something different on the other hand. So so yeah, that's just kind of it. It's really fun and exciting and um, something different that we haven't done before, probably. Maybe some of you have had a henna before. 
Um, yeah, I get so into it, I can't even talk. So anyways, that's just my quick thing here. I'm gonna write just the word henna on here so you know what it's called, but that is my head of hands. Really simple, kind of fun um, activity. Obviously they do it on their hands. I would not suggest it unless you have the right kind of markers or if your parents say it's okay, that's fine. But um, I wouldn't do it without asking your parents for permission. But that is Henna and that is our activity for today. We will be back. Um, the girls are working on um, some Rangali outside, but I'm gonna wait to do the activities until they had finished with that. So um, we will see you in a little while. Um, we are going to do the Rangali and then tomorrow we are learning about Europe. So I'm excited about that one. It's one of my favorite countries. So we will see you later. Namaste everybody. Bye.